In the meantime, new at 5, a local discovery thrilling scientists across San Diego. A find in Mission Valley now giving a new understanding of our ancient history. 10 News reporter Travis Rice reveals the fossils that show monkeys used to roam San Diego County. This is what's left of some of San Diego's earliest residents. A tooth is worth a thousand words. But it's more than enough for anthropology professor Chris Kirk. You are sampling um, a completely new branch on the tree of life. He and fellow scientist Amy Atwater are credited with just identifying three new extinct primate species from what were previously just old bones collected by the San Diego Natural History Museum while Mission Valley was being developed in the 80s and 90s. It's pretty rare in this day and age the 21st century, anywhere in the lower 48 to come across not just one, not just two, but three new species of fossil primates found in a major metropolitan area. The newly named trio are called Omomyoids, and from left to right, it's Gunnaltarsius, Brontomomys, and Equiomachius, named after the Koyamaka Native Americans. In San Diego, 45, 42 million years ago, you had a community of primates living in the tropical forest. And before you ask, we are related. Omomyoids are most closely related to the living tarsiers, monkeys, apes, and humans. And so the direct fossil evidence for the earliest stages of human evolution are represented by the omomyoids. It looks like Mission Valley was packed back then too. And when you're walking around your local Ikea in San Diego, you know, under several feet of concrete beneath your feet, there may be an amazing collection of uh, Eocene fossil mammals. Travis Rice, 10 News. Well, the fossils are at the Natural History Museum in Balboa Park, but they are not currently on display for the public. Hmm.